Biden promises more U.S. strikes on Iranian-linked militia targets. President Joe Biden has defended the U.S. response to a recent drone strike that left three American soldiers dead, explaining that the air raids have targeted militia groups in Iraq and Syria, allegedly backed by Iran. In a statement, Biden said he personally ordered the Pentagon's response to last weekend's deadly drone strike on a Jordanian military base housing U.S. troops. At my direction, U.S. military forces struck targets at facilities in Iraq and Syria that the Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps and affiliated militia use to attack U.S. forces, the president said, referring to Tehran's Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps, an elite military unit. Our response began, Biden stated, adding that retaliatory strikes would continue at times and places of our choosing. U.S. Defense Chief Lloyd Austin also warned that the latest round of strikes is just the start of our response, adding that the president has directed additional actions. The facilities that were struck included command and control operations, centers, intelligence centers, rockets and missiles and unmanned aerial vehicle storages and logistics and munition supply chain facilities of militia groups and their Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps sponsors who facilitated attacks against U.S. and coalition forces, he added. Lieutenant General Douglas Sims, the director of the Joint Chiefs of Staff, said that the locations of the strikes were chosen with an idea that there would likely be casualties among the IRGC and militia personnel who use them. B-1 bombers, long-range heavy bombers that can deploy precision and non-precision weapons were used in the operations.